it's finally here. 30 days come and gone. Another retro game treasures box, hopefully filled with some retro game goodies. Stick around, we'll open this up, see if we got anything good. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, like the video if you do like it. I do plenty of these retro video game type pickups and box unboxing videos, um, also along with some new age VR reaction videos too. Feel free to check them out. There are links gonna be in the description, but let's get into this box and see if the $42 a month that I'm spending, if if I should maybe reevaluate my budgeting and maybe adjust it, put it somewhere else other than a randomized video game box. <laughs> Let's get into it. So you're first greeted with um, packing stuff. Of course, they want to keep everything nice so it doesn't get all messed up in shipping. Um, after that, you get your first video game, which I've not ever seen this game before. Uh, this is an NES game, Nintendo game, Tiger Heli. I have no description to give you on this. Um, didn't really research it ahead of time, so this is my first time seeing this game. I'm putting gameplay footage along with um, you getting to hear me in the background or maybe seeing it in a box over here. Uh, but with the, uh, I, I find it hard to believe that this is anything rare. Um, it's by uh, um, Taito. Uh, that is a manufacturer that uh, I know fairly well. Uh, they do have a, a couple of pretty good games out there, some classics like Bubble Bobble and some other things for, for the Nintendo um, Entertainment System. So that's uh, number one. We're going to move on to number two. Feels kind of like there's about three of them in here. Now keep in mind the price point of $42 to see. I'm going to be calculating this up somewhere so uh, you'll be able to see if, if I did indeed get my money's worth. I'm hoping. Okay, the next one, we're going to kind of keep in that airspace theme but this is with PlayStation 2. This is Sky Odyssey. This is another one of those titles that um, I can't really give you any kind of description on. Um, I have never ever seen this game before. Um, honestly, it looks like something that could be on a dollar rack to be, to be completely honest. I'm looking at the back, uh, graphics are decent. Um, I, I don't believe this is going to bring us up to that price point, especially even with the other one too, but I'm still hopeful. We've got one more game. Let's get into it. Let's hopefully see if we can make our money's worth. Okay, so I'm not hating on this at all. It's an Xbox game, but I'm going to tell you, it does not have much value. It is Tiger Woods PGA Golf 06. Um, the Tiger Woods games... I do like them a lot. Um, I don't, I'm not opposed to playing them. They are fun. Um, but again, they're not high dollar games by all means. So they're two, I, I picked this up for $2 for, for GameCube. So I'm assuming it's probably got that same kind of value. Now, of course, somewhere here is gonna have my total of what everything's worth. So you can judge for yourself if Getting the um, Retro Game Treasures box is worth it. Uh, for me, like I said, I have ups and downs. Last month was kind of a down. This month seems like a down. I don't think, they're gonna have to do something extraordinary to really change my mind on this because I'll go on adventure and say that maybe this isn't the greatest way to spend your money if you're a retro game collector. Um, I think I'm gonna probably stick to finding games at my local game store, you know. But you can never resist a mystery box. That's what I've come to find out, so yeah. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give me that thumbs up, hit the subscribe button for more. Uh, keep in mind, I'm trying to post at least two videos a week from my game store pickups to VR gameplay, um, along with these mystery box videos too. And I'll put a link in the description, as I said, for. Uh, all the additional content that I have on my page if you'd like to check out some more videos. Uh, but meanwhile, if you want to see some more retro stuff, you can click this link.
If VR is more your thing, you can click this link. Don't forget to subscribe, because it's right here. It literally is right here. All you gotta do is click it. Click it, you know you want to. Click it, click it. We'll see you next time.